Hello, San Jose Unified Community. This is Superintendent Nancy Albron. The past 15 months have been a unique time for our district. We've weathered many storms in our 168 year history, but the COVID-19 pandemic was the first time our schools were closed to students for so long. When schools throughout California were ordered to close in the spring of 2020, San Jose Unified pivoted to meet the immediate needs of our students, families, and employees. We set up a grab and go meal program, providing over 300,000 meals a month to those who needed them. We gave our employees time to care for their own families. Most importantly, we reached out to every student to make sure they had a connection with their school and access to the social and emotional support that was crucial during that initial lockdown. Many of our families were facing job loss, food insecurity, and unstable housing. This extreme uncertainty required actions that offered stability and ensured the health of our community. Over the past summer, it became clear that schools would not return to normal anytime soon. So we focused on creating and delivering a distance learning program that would provide live instruction to all of our students for the full school day. San Jose Unified was well positioned with strong financial reserves, allowing us to rapidly purchase and distribute 26,000 tablets, laptops, and hotspots to all those who needed them. We also deployed a platform that allowed over 1,200 teachers to manage their online classrooms and gave parents real-time access to their students' progress. Our goal was to connect with every one of our 28,000 students, letting them know that someone cares not only about their academic success, but also their emotional well-being during extremely challenging circumstances. At the beginning of 2021, we became more confident that a return to in-person learning was both necessary and possible. Our strong partnership with labor groups allowed us to craft a comprehensive return to school plan that brought students back for the full school day, five days a week, while also providing the flexibility we needed to adapt to changing health conditions. As we prepare for the next school year, we are closely monitoring CDC and state requirements so we can continue to provide the safest possible experience for our students and employees. We know in-person learning is the best experience for our students. We thank you for your patience and support of our students and staff. With the experiences of the last year behind us, we are more prepared than ever for what lies ahead. We look forward to welcoming all of our students back next school year and are excited to see our campuses full once again.